Hello, Tesseract. My name is Daniel Holter. I'm here to give you a quick introduction to the course we are calling Discovery 101. And this is the Agitare team we've assembled for you. What's up, Tesseract? Chris here with Agitare. Hi, Tesseract. My name is Dustin Thomas. Hey, Tesseract. I'm Marcus Carrion, but you can call me Cut. Over the course of three hours this Wednesday, we'll be sharing with you a rapid-fire introduction to a number of different facilitated discovery methods derived from frameworks such as design thinking, human-centered design, think wrong, warfighter-centered design, systems thinking, and more. What we want most to convey over the course of this workshop is the power of these methods when you wield them within your organization. We did receive an idea for a potential problem set that you might want to dig into, but we're going to go a little bit wider at the start and give you the space to really explore all of the potential problems you might dig into before converging on a single one. And then we're going to give you the space and a few exercises to potentially start getting after potential solutions. Now, three hours is not really enough time to truly give a difficult problem set its due diligence. And you want to do user research and involve users and more people and a little bit more time in the discovery process. But we do want to use something that you actually care about to explore the methods we hope you'll want to adopt for this and future problem sets in as inclusive, co-creative, and innovative a way as possible. We will be using the virtual whiteboard Miro for this workshop, which you can see behind me on the screen. So you need to be on a desktop computer with access to Miro.com and the ability to connect to our Zoom call. Once you get on the Miro board, there will be instructions for how to use that, and we will start with the with a warm-up exercise that'll give you a chance to dig into the functionality. Uh, so that to make sure that everybody who's participating has the capacity to, to actually use the tool because that's an important part. We are looking forward to spending a few hours exploring with you. We uh, have done this exercise or this workshop six times now and it is always a unique and fascinating experience. So check, uh, check out agitare.org for more info about what we're all about. Looking forward to it. Thanks.